it's a beautiful morning good morning today is another day it's a sunday guys church or no church church always church why not praising god and thanking him for everything guys yes he has given us the gift of life and we thank him and today I'm waking up to see a new day that he has made for me to rejoice and be glad in. And I'm thanking you for I'm thanking him for the gift of life. Are you thanking God, however the case? Yes, we ought to thank God for this far. He has protected us, He has given us this breath. Imagine that time that you are sleeping, you did not even know yourself, and in the morning he hit you up like this to wake up. He gave you that breath. And hey. Did you wake up limping? No. Did you wake up feeling sick? No. And if you did, God is the healer. He is healing you. He's going to heal you. Ask and he'll heal you guys. So this morning I'm happy. I'm going to go to church. It's a morning. I'm prepared. All I'm not, I've not put on my, 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 my wig because I'm wondering whether my wig will fit in, in this hair. <laughs> you see, this is the traditional hair that I've been having. And I'm wondering if I should go to church with this hair or with this uh, cap, ballet. Or should I wear a wig? But I'm wondering how a wig will sit because of this bulk behind here, guys. So I still can go this way. Our church is not a, uh, it's not a church. It's not a place where you can be judged or anything. So guys, mine was to say hi, good morning. And... Um, to encourage you that this is a day a new day that god has made and that we should rejoice in it those that are waiting for the results i know we all are waiting for the results we will continue waiting with patience and we know god will give us uh, the winner sooner than later and whoever wins we will support them we will support them because god is the one that um uh, keeps uh, somebody in power he's the one who appoints and um, disappoints <laughs> does God disappoint I don't know if God disappoints but I know that God is the one that will give us the presidency and he's the one who will anoint that one whom he wants uh, that he leads us and guys be patient and wait wait upon the Lord even the Bible says wait upon the Lord wait upon the Lord yes let's wait upon the Lord Whatever comes, mine is just to say, whatever comes, let's agree. Let's not fight. Let's just embrace whoever comes. And let me tell you something. You and I may never even, even ever go to that house on, on the hill. And if we shall ever go there, it will be a blessing. But why should I fight my neighbor? Why should I fight my neighbor? Why should my neighbor hate me? I'm not going to hate anybody. I'm not going to fight anybody. I will just love whoever God, God puts in place. Because my issues will continue being my issues. And um, these people will always be there. If I fight you, I become your enemy. These people will never know if you fight me the same. So let's love one another. Let them come and lead. Let them come and lead. Whoever leads. But let us.